good morning guys and welcome back to the channel so it is um sunday the 26th of september it's been a few days since i vlogged sorry y'all um basically i just didn't have time to edit that video so i didn't have storage to keep filming but um i think i should be good for today i'm hoping um so it is 11.07. I'm about to head back home because um, I need to do laundry. Mittens had an accident last night and um, a couple, like a week ago she had an accident on my comforter. Um, like she accidentally threw up on my comforter. And I don't know, she's been acting weird. So I want to get some of her like anxiety treats from home and stuff. And I just have a whole list, get my fall decorations, get my comforter and everything. So like my other comforter, I need to wash this one, but I still just want to get my other one. So I'm just gonna head home for the day because I don't have any time to like really go. I don't think like until literally Halloween. So I figure I would just go and get everything taken care of, take the drive and um, I might do some shift orders out there, but I figure I would vlog for you guys today just, you know, to show you everything going on. So my trunk is filled with laundry right now of all kinds. I've got my backpack so I can bring stuff home and bring stuff back. Um, and my purse and everything so we're gonna head out okay guys while i was gone my mom like completely redecorated so i thought it'd be cute to show you guys look how freaking adorable this little setup is you can't really see it but the tea light is lit camera's not picking it up we got new furniture that's gonna go on the door cute wreath 20 bucks freaking walmart love it so cute and then over here she just got this for bath and body so freaking cute so freaking cute got a record player in the corner i really love this shelf and the night or the end tables like match perfectly with everything like what a vibe big chair gotta love her ignore all the shoes i kind of made it a mess in here not gonna lie all my stuff and then like this clock she got from like an amish town when we went to um Pennsylvania. The little gnome. Kind of hard to see him. So freaking cute. So freaking cute. So overall, this is what it looks like. And then we just moved around the backyard. So this is what the backyard looks like. We just moved this bench over here. Like, I love the orange. It's so freaking cute. So freaking cute. We need a new fireplace, but it's okay wide view i don't know i'm kind of obsessed like the orange is just i don't know love it these freaking pillows like look at these freaking pillows look at these freaking pillows they're so cute so cute 10 out of 10 and then my mom also made me dinner look how freaking good this looks and look at these decorations how freaking cute the freaking owl so freaking cute 10 out of 10 in here hey guys so it is the next day it is monday the 27th um i yesterday didn't film very much but as i'm editing i'm gonna kind of explain like what i was showing and everything that happened yesterday i'll show you everything that or like kind of explain it in, like now also but um i'm gonna go back home again tonight um i'm just waiting for this dog to be picked up so i'm gonna kind of show you guys like how i'm gonna go about that um i already have everything that i'm gonna pack laid out on my bed right now um this is kind of what it's looking like um there's a few pieces of laundry that i need to bring home and wash um either that i missed or that i wore yesterday or whatever i figure i might as well just you know do one last load while i'll be home tonight um that I literally took like a four hour nap today. I am just so fucking tired lately. But anyways, I figure I would pack with you guys. So in my backpack already, I have my school stuff. Um, in here I have some pads and tampons. I'm not on my beard anymore, but I'm just gonna leave it in there. I have some razors I'm borrowing from someone. And then um, my planner, a notebook and a folder, um, some mints, oh a granola bar um and some random like hand lotion and stuff in the front pocket so anyways i thought i would show you guys like what i'm gonna be packing um like to go back home just for tonight i will be back 
at my apartment tomorrow night. I do have two packages coming tomorrow. I'm very excited about them. My mom ordered me a trash can. Praise her freaking soul. And then um, I ordered myself a bed frame. So I figure uh, tomorrow's vlog will probably be in this one too. I'm going to edit everything I have so far tonight and we'll see kind of where we're at. I'm not sure. Um, let me know what kind of videos you guys like as far as like do you guys like long vlogs or short vlogs or what's up because like i some a couple times now have uploaded like 20 to 30 minute vlogs and i'm like that is too long <laughs> but also like i'm i, I don't want to watch myself so it's like i don't know if it's just boring to me or if it, they're really just boring anywho um next thing i'm going to pack is my ipad um for editing tonight and everything oh also i do have my mini notebook in here for my um like I write a lot of lists in here so I have like a shopping list um home decoration list that I want to buy that's all that's in here and oh and then I have for the 25th of September I have a to-do list um I haven't done one since then and it's the 27th but that's because I these last two days have been a little unpredictable but anywho um so that's kind of what I got going on and then gonna bring my mascara and my curler i've got my iphone charger my apple watch charger and then i've got okay so my mom sent me home with like a bunch of supplements so i'm gonna show you guys like everything that i'm starting to take to see like hopefully my tiredness improve so first thing birth control taking that with I think I have some at home but I can't remember and it's not something I really want to chance I've got my hair skin and nails gummies right now I'm taking the ones with collagen in it I really 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 like these um I usually these don't come in like a huge bottle so I usually don't get the ones with collagen in it um because it's cheaper for the bigger bottle but um they didn't have a big bottle anyways so I just got the ones with collagen in it anyways all of these have biotin in it some people their skin does not like that mine does i've got some airborne because you know we'd be getting sick out here i've got some iron because i'm anemic i've got two allergy pills left um i'm gonna just take these tonight and tomorrow and see if i see like improvement in how i'm feeling because i don't know if my allergies are still here or not i can't, I can't even tell i've got some garlic which is good for cardiovascular health and i have heart problems that run in my family so um trying to take those but if it takes like makes my breath smell I'm not going to take it anymore because um I'm a hairdresser and like I have to be really conscious about those, th those things I've got zinc for which is just really good for you in general but especially for your immune system and then I've got vitamin d d3 um because I have not been able to tan and I get like bad seasonal depression and um just don't feel good like when I don't get enough vitamin d so um I started taking these my mom got these for me so that's what we got for supplements I've already basically just filled up my freaking backpack I've got two pairs of socks um I'm gonna wear these on my way home because I'm not wearing socks right now so I've got a pair of socks that I'm gonna pack put those in there um Actually, I'm gonna wait a second to put the socks in there. I have Cetaphil face lotion, nope, Cetaphil face lotion and Cetaphil um, daily facial cleanser. I really like these and I like them together primarily because they balance each other out if it dries you out too much or makes you too oily, whatever. Um, they're just really good together. I This is one of the things that's like really cleared up my skin. Um, not for everyone though, but I think I have some of this at home, but I can't even remember because I haven't stayed the night at home in so long. So I'm just going to bring it just in case. So I've got those two things. And then I have my Aveda Cherry Almond um, Leave-In Conditioner. I really, really, really like these, this stuff. Like I highly recommend to anyone that's looking for a leave-in conditioner. It doesn't make your hair greasy. It does just enough moisturizing, makes it smell great. Like it, literally my hair is so, it was so damaged at one point that it was breaking off when I brushed it into my lap. And it feels virgin when I put this in it. So 10 out of 10, love it. My mom uses it too and she loves it. Um, I've got deodorant, pretty sure I have some of that at home too, but once again, I don't even remember. This came in my birth control package. My mom is paying for my birth control right now because we switched 
because I was on the pill club, but then they found out I wasn't 18, so I was kicked off of it. So I, then I had to go to the doctor and actually get birth control. Um, but I didn't like the one that they kept putting me on, so I gave my mom that one, and I'm taking hers because she got the one that I do like. Anyway, so she just gave me the whole package, but this has Brazilian bum bum cream in it, which I do kind of want to try, but um, I figure I would give her first dibs on it um, because she's paying for it. And then also these Hype Bites it came with. So I thought I'd see if she wanted either of these before I used them. Um, yeah. So I'm gonna bring those home and see if she wants them. A bra. So right now I am wearing gray leggings and a white shirt and I figure I would pretty much reuse that tomorrow. But I brought an extra bra just in case there's something at home that I wanted to wear instead. Um, and then I've got these pair of pants because just in case we go out anywhere which I highly doubt we will I don't know I want to be prepared so I figure I could wear these with this white shirt and I was gonna bring these black shoes I'll probably just wear them home um because I thought like this would be a cute fit um and then I also have this jean jacket that I thrifted and then um distressed myself you can't it's kind of hard to like hold this up properly but if you've watched any of my past videos you've seen it multiple times so um i wear these home and then i also have my gray vans in my car already so if i want a different pair of shoes i have those and then i do have a couple pairs of shoes at home so then oh wait oopsies our next thing i'm gonna pack is my night shirt um it's just an oversized walmart t-shirt that I'm gonna put in there. Um, I've got my sweats. And then I have three pairs of underwear, um, just in case something happens. I know I'm only staying one night, but I mean, you never know. Extra underwear and extra socks is always good. I really should grab another pair of socks, to be honest with you. But I also have laundry in here, and I wouldn't be surprised if there's a pair of socks. And I also have socks at home. Um, and I have underwear, but I don't like any of them. And then I'm bringing home this laundry. It's not very much. Um, I just have a bath towel in there and then a couple of like rags and a pair of socks and just random stuff. But the biggest thing is the towel. Um, Cause I only have two towels, like body towels right now. And I'm using that one, that one's dirty. Um, which like would last me till the next time I do laundry because I primarily use my robe. I kind of just like, I don't know. Anyways, I don't wash my towel every time I use it. Call me gross, I don't really care. And then I'm going to bring my purse home and I'm going to zip this up. I've got my water bottle. There we go. Um, I don't need my chapstick. I got that. And then, okay, so I've got my purse, my backpack with my water bottle and my laundry. And then I... I am. I know I'm only going home for one night, but I am going to bring my cats with me because, first of all, look how cute Levi is. I am going to bring my cats home with me because, um... Levi has been really bored here lately, and I think he just needs a change, change of scenery just for a night, so I'm going to bring him with. Um, hold momentarily. So, I was just checking if the dog owner has texted me back yet. He has not. He um, texted me at, like, 5 o'clock. It's 6.30. It's 6.24. And said, because um, he's on vacation, he said, okay, I'm going to stop at my apartment, throw my bags down, and then come pick him up. Is that good? And I was like, yeah, that's fine. So, um... Although I didn't think it would take this long, which is fine, but I'm kind of just waiting on that. So I'm going to grab all of this stuff and I'm going to go put it in my car other than my purse because I think this is all that I need. And then actually, you guys are sitting on my blanket. I think I'm going to bring my blanket with me also. Um, I'll probably just put it in my bag with my laundry and then I'm going to get the cat carriers down and ready, get them ready to go. Um, so that way, when as soon as he gets picked up, I can just go home. Because right now, we're already looking at 8 o'clock if he showed up, like, right now, too. So, I'm hoping he doesn't show up too much later because I thought it would be fun to make my mom, like, keto brownies tonight. Because she's doing keto right now. 
very proud of her. She's um, doing very well. It takes a lot of self-control <laughs> that I don't have. Um, anyway, so I thought it would be fun to make her keto brownies tonight as long as we have everything. But Brooklyn said she would make brownies with me too. I didn't tell her they were keto brownies, but it's okay. Um, so I figure if my mom doesn't have everything, we'll just run to the store really quick so that I can like pick up supplies and make her those. Because um, I keep making her eat bad and I don't mean to. I just forget that she's like doing that. I mean, like, she, yeah, she could say no, too, but it's, like, like, yesterday when we went to Taco Bell when we went out shopping and stuff, so it was, I don't know, forgetting about that, so, um, I wanted to do something fun, but also that she can have and not feel bad about, so, anywho, I'm gonna get my socks and shoes on and this jean jacket, I'll show you guys what that looks like on, and then I'm, I need to, like, get some of the stuff out of my back seat and, like, make it not a mess, kind of. So um, I'll film like the before and after of that and then how, where I put everything in the car. Um, Cause I put the cats in the back seat and I put my stuff in my trunk. And then in the front seat, I just put um, my purse. And then if anything doesn't fit somewhere else, I'll put it in the front seat. But um, yeah, so let's do this. My mirror's behind my door and he's laying right there. So I don't want to move him. But this is kind of like what this looks like. Sorry, very awkward angle. Um, then I've got my purse bag which has my blanket in it backpack and he just texted me saying he's on his way so um i'm gonna bring this stuff down in my car and like move things around and i'll show you guys that and then by then um he should be about here and he can get his dog and i can get the cats together all right so first thing i'm gonna do because my purse is fragile ah, let's do one of these numbers go have that over there those are my vans oh okay all right i guess that's going on look what i did to my car y'all whatever so this is the situation and the cats need to go here so basically how i deal with this is i put that down there and grab her put her down there life of a cosmetology student put that down there grab her I don't even know why I have this bag this one's up there one handed life okay alright there we go perfect so now it's all cleared out for the cats kind of ish good enough um, and then I need so if you guys know how to open my trunk, I have a Buick Regal 2012, uh, let me know because I don't know how to do it other than on my keys. I've had my car for over a year and I still can't figure it out and you know what, my keys are not even in my purse. So, I forgot they were on there. Alright. Backpack. Not showing my license plate. It smells really weird back here. Grab this. It's probably one of these sodas getting ready to explode. Just put them back there. Also, I'm going to do this off camera because it's going to be a pain on camera, but I need to put this across. Because I like to put things in here if I'm worried about it rolling around. Or you can open it too. So, yeah, that's really nice. Anyways, this is what it looks like. And we are now going to get the cat carrier down. I have one that compresses and I'm going to put that one together really quick. And then just get the other one down. Um, and the cat should be easy to get in there. And get Leo's stuff together so that way they're all ready to go. Alright guys, and this is how I set them up. I have them facing each other because I feel like it makes them feel better. Mittens gave me a pain in the ass, but it's alright. I got them both in here now. 